Okay, everyone. This officially opened selections. This is Bernie and uh, Bash's litter. First generation sheepadoodles. Typical tuxedo puppies um, that uh, Bernie has always given us. She's a solid tuxedo. Um, by solid, I mean she's a party, but she's definitely a true tuxedo, and that's what she tends to throw. Um, anyway, these are beautiful puppies, great personalities. Moms are wanting in, and I've got this video and the video of um, Mina's litter to do. I'm not going to get to still photos today. I'm really, really sorry. I'm anxious to do them. I've already set up their background and everything, but uh, we're still kind of in the throes of the holiday visits and um my son and his wife and family are on their way back from ohio they were with us through christmas day went to ohio to visit with my daughter-in-law's family and now are on their way back here and we'll be leaving for florida uh driving back to florida on new year's day so i treasure every moment i have with my family especially my son and his family who live so far away because our times together are far and few between. So um, as soon as things settle down after this weekend, then I will try to be more diligent. We also had two new litters I have not featured yet. Uh, the last of which was born, which was Raina's litter. Beautiful eight puppies, eight big healthy puppies. Um, and they were born Sunday, this past Sunday. Today being December 29th, Tuesday the 29th. So they're two days old or three days old. So, um, and Lovey's, of course, which was a long, grueling uh, labor, but yet netted us some beautiful puppies, uh, nonetheless. So, um, excited to feature them as well. So, I've got a lot of work ahead of me for you guys so that I can get these things up on my website. My website looks a little bit differently, that different. That was just changing template. I'm still with the same software. My son, uh, prompted a major update to my Mac the other day and I held my breath. It took all day to do, but I was so fearful that my Sandbox um, software, which is what is my, through my website, wasn't gonna come back. And at one point it disappeared, um, but I was able to search it and finally found it and it is still working. Um, that's why I'm trying to build a new website because we no longer have the developer updates or anything like that for the sandbox so software and um, many of us i follow a page on facebook with sandbox users are fearful that one day we just won't be able to access our websites at all and that that could be devastating so i am in the process of building a new website just um uh, bear with me as we get that done all right okay let's uh introduce so we can get moms in after i do mina's litter this is our light blue boy and yes they need a brush out okay and you won't believe how different they're going to look after their first bath post weaning which will be in a couple of weeks okay um and but that was another reason i really want to take a picture <laughs> because they really need a little bit of brushing yes yeah, fluffy up slimy little puppies okay there's a light pink girl and this is our red girl, very friendly. Hi, sweetheart. Yes, again, our light blue boy. Uh, I believe that's our black boy being lazy over there. Okay. Oh, yawn. And this is our dark blue boy. Actually, our black boy and our dark blue boy look a lot alike. They're marked almost identical. Okay, this is my half face girl. <laughs> Yeah, she's a cutie. She is the purple collared girl. Yeah. All right, dark pink. Beautiful symmetrical mask on her. Nice big white collar. Okay. Um, so there's only eight puppies in this litter. Somebody's hiding back here. Oh, that's my red girl. Yeah. I'm going to get you, you guys, breakfast. I almost gave it to them while they were over in the holding pen while I was cleaning their box, but I knew they'd be covered in it, so I just made them wait. Besides, sometimes after they eat, they turn into food coma, so I wanted them to be a little bit active still when I came over to introduce them. Okay, I knew we were forgetting somebody. This is our little white-faced girl. This is our aqua-colored girl. You are dirty, aren't you? You dirty. 
Yeah, we're working on training these guys to the potty. I've seen a couple of them doing it, but this has not been a very clean litter, and Mom is no longer cleaning up after them, so we have quite a mess to deal with already with these guys. Where Mina is keeping her babies clean. All moms are different. Oh, I love your little stripe on your bottom. This is our dark pink girl. All right. Now, I know they're not real active yet. It is a little bit... Uh, early. It's amazing what a, week, a difference a week will make. But um, I am officially opening selections on this litter and Mina's litter. Um, so I will be in contact as time allows um, to get things moving along on these litters. I know that sometimes it's hard to really make a decision. Um, based on videos, we do do our best. There's our pink colored girl, dark pink. And that's our light pink colored girl. Look at those tails go. Oh, and then you're going to go pick on your quiet little sister, huh? She says, I don't want to play. And somebody else here is being lazy. That's our dark blue boy. Yeah. And who's over here? Want I know you're hungry, aren't you? That's our light blue boy. I'll go get your food. Don't worry. It's coming. All right. Purple collar girl again. Red. She's a real sweetheart. She's very outgoing, very friendly. And then Mr. Lazy Black. He's our, actually our biggest puppy in the litter. I haven't weighed them yet. Um, there he is. Nice, big, white chest. Yeah. All right. So, oh, okay. If I can get up, I'll take a little bit of a bub shot while the puppies move around. This is Law Padoodle Canine Manor. Our current website is www.lawpdoodlek, the number nine, manor.com. Again, this is December 29th, 2020. Uh, looking forward to seeing 2020 in the rearview mirror. No, I don't even want to look there. Uh, let's say that we just actually, I have plans of sleeping through the new year because, not the whole day, just I'm not going to stay up for the bong bong at night because... I would rather wake up and know it's gone forever. Just my humble opinion. So I do hope and pray that everybody will have a wonderful, blessed 2021 ahead. The Lord is good. Thank you for viewing our puppies and may God bless you.